we have a cultural gala which is going to take place between 26 to 2028 it will be a three days event the first day on the 26th we shall have a cleaning of the city that is the one of the activities we shall clean our winter market we shall clean uh, the main market then we go to labedra market that will end for the 26 we only invite people culture loving people to come and support us we need uh, we need uh, brooms for sweeping we need gloves for for, 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 uh, for sweeping, we need something to help the people who are going to participate to make it a good day. That will be the first day. The second day, we shall have a march from Awindiri driving through what we call drive. What is it? What is it? Street drive. We shall move the whole city. That is also still morning hours, and it will and around uh, 11 midday then around 2 the obim arrival of the obimo at the site at the venue so it will the, the team will welcome obimo and that will take that will end from that time obimo up to the the obimo will talk to us it will take around from around two to about uh, five. Then from five we shall have uh, some entertainment. Uh, entertainment will, will end around ten. Then the third day we shall crown it all by having aguara from two and also stop. We shall have aguara and there also they will stop around that time. We don't want, we are put in place security to take care of everybody at the venue. We shall have the army, we shall have the police, we shall have the local security arrangement. Alur community, Arua is an affiliate of Alur Kingdom, which is the main kingdom. We are the subject, like the chair said. Our main purpose here is to reach out to people, tell them what is happening. Alur Kashiro Gala 2024 was first shared for. 27th to 31st, I think that was last year, but because of one or two things, we decided to push it to this year, that is from 26th to 28th, it is a three days event. Uh, our theme for this year, like you said, is promoting the girl child. We have got our own, that is Honorable Counselor. We are gender sensitive, we have brought her here especially, I mean specifically to talk about the theme. Why should we choose promoting girl child? Because, as you know, if you go right now down in the villages, as I'm talking right now, they don't mind of that child education, you see? They've seen that a girl has no value. Since childhood, you know, when a, a girl is born even in the loop, they say, you, you first go, you, you go and get married. Those days, eh? at least this time now, people, the eyes are opening up. But this, those days, go and get married to a clan in a loop, and uh, you give birth to the first child, it's a girl. That one, there, no problem. The second one, again, a girl. You begin now. You begin. People begin talking behind. You have come to cut to kill the what the clan, because they believe that what is called a clan is a what is a male child, but that is not it. A girl child can also make a clan. So I want to tell them that time that it is high time people should open their eyes that girls are also very very important. Even if you look at in the Bible, God knew very well that a woman is important. That's why He had to create Adam amid this hook. Eve. Because at time at, at first Adam was alone, he was lonely. So when you look at that, meaning that a girl is very very important, a woman is very very important. So we have to tell the world as a lure that we should educate girl child, so that the society is changed. We should tell people the mindset should change. This mindset of saying that women are useless. No, they are not. They are very very important. I think that is the major core of that word of that gala. We want to tell them that women are important and as a rule we should not look at women as being something which is very use useless or just something to bring for you money. No, 